Hi. Um, this is part two of today. Um, I went to a physical um, medical, it's like a rehab lady. Um, she's a doctor and she had a measuring device that's like a ruler, like a fold out ruler, but in the middle there's a circle and then she would put it at my joints, the circle, and then each ruler t would go out and then it would measure the degree of hypermobility. Um, and so it was the exact degree in, in hypermobility, it's 10 degrees or more. Um, my knees and my arms were 15 degrees. Uh, again, that's making me still wonder about what was the issues on Wednesday. Um, but before this trip, I knew very little about fibromyalgia, and I still do know very little. I know it, I thought it was a set, set of some painful symptoms, which I didn't really feel that I fit. Now I somewhat understand that it is points on the body. Um, I still don't understand much about it. I need to learn more. I did a stress test. My heart rate went up to 200. My blood pressure was higher during the stress test than it has been the whole trip that I've been here. Um, going back to some of the things the neuro said this morning that I didn't cover, I have um, many types of POTS. Um, I have not heard of vascular POTS, which I had heard of vascular EDS. Of course, I, are, I have hyper, um, but he also named like two others. Um, I didn't write them down, my bad. Uh, he diagnosed me with migraines, um, but was worried that the meds for migraines would make my POTS and fibromyalgia worse. Tomorrow I see a cardiologist, then some tests at an endocrinologist. Um, what are these tests? If you've had them, I have no clue what these tests are going to be. Um, I'm not supposed to eat for four hours, um, but I am supposed to take my medicine, so I don't know. Then MRA and MRI. The neuro is still working on getting me into a vascular specialist and hasn't happened yet. So I guess they want um, the ultrasound of the aorta or some kind of um, vein test before I'm seen. And they haven't got those in yet. Um, so. Um, pretty much, I'm just tired. Um, it's not even 8 o'clock. I've been ready for bed and for a long time. Um, miss my family. Um, I feel silly about some of these appointments because how many times can you diagnose me with the same things and still have no solid plan? It's not... Um, Well, I guess I'm going to go to bed. Um, my head hurts really bad. Um, I'll have more updates tomorrow. Um, they do not like the constant high heart rate, so I'm kind of worried about does that mean an ablation? I um, already went down that line and didn't really want it back then. You know, I understand that. It could be good, but I'm still kind of not for it. But if I was have it done anywhere, I guess I'd rather have it done here. Um, I will talk to you guys tomorrow. Thanks. Bye.